Hey, it's Ninja Boy. Welcome back once again to another Mario World Hunted Bowser's Secret. This is actually the fourth video I'm doing in my recording session. I normally do three, like I've mentioned a few times now, but I'm not gonna lie. I kind of wanted to see what Bowser's Secret was and what was going on with uh, World 7, because it kind of threw a few things at me that I was not expecting, like not going directly up to the castle, which I thought was going to be the thing, and not going up to the uh, fortress, which I thought was going to be the thing. So I am actually very curious as to where this is going. So I also kind of thought Bowser's Secret was going to be like a secret stash level, but uh, again, <laughs> I was wrong. And do that. Jump on this. Let it go down a little bit. So I can survive. There we go. Fudge. Oh well. Not really that difficult of a thing to do, get the dragon coin. Bop, bop, and bop. Kind of thought I was going to miss the snake for a second there after getting the dragon coin. I thought I didn't jump far enough. But where does that go? So that goes up to the fortress. So let's do the fortress. Bowser's Fortress. That probably goes to the back door. And, okay... I was going to try and, like, weasel my way up there. But, uh, it didn't, didn't work very well. Kind of... The block snakes really just feel like they're thrown in. Like, hey, I kind of want to use this thing. Also, I was not expecting the lava to rise as far up as it did. But, yeah, it kind of feels like, hey... I want to use this, uh, thing that I used in the last level. So it just kind of seems thrown in a little bit. I mean, it's not too bad, but definitely just kind of feels thrown in. Yeah, I was... I was, uh, not expecting the lava to rise as far as it did. I didn't actually notice fudge it rising at first, but then I was like, oh, shoot. It is rising. And then I was dead. Because, yeah, I didn't, I didn't see it falling. And then I got on that platform and then I was like, oh, it's rising. Oh, well. Kind of an interesting little setup. Not too hard to deal with. Oh, I thought that was going to pop up. Hey, look, I get a feather. Resnor. Again. Oops, I missed. Oh, now my thing is all thrown off. Oh, boy, this is terrible. This is now how I want the fight to go at all. I'd usually do a quick kill on him. That's, well, probably not as quick as you could, but fairly quick. And it just didn't work this time. So that goes to back door. Yeah, Bowser's back door. I will probably go into that first just to see what that's all about. Bowser's Land 2. Red exited level. So I need to figure out where both of those are in this one. Well, that I was not expecting. Kind of like went into a castle just to leave a castle. <laughs> why? I'm so bad at keeping feathers in this game, and I don't know why. It's not even that hard to keep them. I'm just playing really badly.
That is just, that's really all it comes down to. I'm just playing really badly. Well, I'm guessing the red switch is going to be the uh, secret exit. I'm glad I had the cape. Wouldn't have been too hard without it because it's just spin jump on the thwomp. But let's do the red switch really quick. That will be all of them. <sighs> Whatever, right. The moon! I got the moon! Moon number one. First moon I've gotten in this uh, hack. Nothing much to say. So yeah, red switch has been gotten into that, from that to that. So now we can go back to this level, I guess, and uh, wonder why you go into a castle and then immediately like leave the castle. Probably because it's using a level that has the uh, castle entrance turned on or no Yoshi entrance turned on and guy probably didn't really know how to turn that off. Which, it's really not hard to do, um, but not everyone actually knows that it's a setting. Because you can modify it, uh, whichever levels have it, the no Yoshi entrance, and turn it off for castles if you really wanted to, and turn it on for normal levels. I think it has to be a specific tile set, um, like the mushroom tile set or something. But, uh, you can turn it on. And even with that, you turn it, make it the mushroom tile set, but then you use extended graphics to change which tiles, graphics, whatever you use. So, there's that. Anyway. That comes up here to Bowser's Land 3. And we can just get going. Oh, massive slowdown. So much slowdown. Well, not super, super slowdown. Was we'll slowed down quite a bit in that little uh, area. It's not too terrible. Here we go. That not actually a hard level at all. Wait, take my time. That I don't want to do because this level really feels like you can just rush through it. Star? Star. Bounce, bounce, bounce. And I need to fly! <laughs> oh, that was the problem with the cape, is I can't run and jump. I run and start flying, and I was trying to get the uh, one-up off of those guys. That's what I was trying to do. Oh, well. It's not like the end of the world, just... End of my little run that I was going to do. This time I'll just run over them like it wants you to do. Not really that big of a deal. I'm going to get a life anyway. Especially if I collect all the coins. I only need four more. Hey look! Four coins. Yeah, I was going to get a life anyway. As I said, I'm probably, actually, I'm very positive I'm going to end the uh, world with our world game. Friggin' end the thing. I should have gotten that power up. I think there was a power up there. End the game with uh, 99 lives. But now, do that get another life that I don't need and be done with this so that goes over to the castle 
Ludwig's Castle. I'll probably just finish off the game. I'm so close to the end. Only a few levels left. Hmm. Power up. Power up. And here. There's a door over there I saw. So red switch makes this easier. Maybe that was a midway point door. I have a feeling I'm right about that. That that was a midway point door. Because uh, midway points cannot be uh, in a sub-level. I mean, you can have the midway point in the sub-level, but where you actually enter uh, has to be in the main level you came in on. And prior to one of the versions of Lunar Magic, that I don't know which one actually updated it, you had to actually be in line with the main entrance. So, like, same level, you can be anywhere in the level, but you had to be, like, the same uh, vertical level. But that's since changed, so you can actually have different heights on the midway point and whatnot. Bump. And let him do this. Spring. Can I get the midair? Yes, and he was going to go off the screen if I didn't do that. So that is all well and good. Get him down all the way. Get no score because I've maxed out my score counter. Maxed it out completely. Thank you! And throw that away. This is it! You've beaten the... Late? I think it's supposed to be late. Koopaling Ludwig von Koopa. Now it's time to face Bowser and beat him like you did all the other times. Let's hope the princess is okay. So, like I said... I am going to go to the back door first. Also, I'm, I wanted to just press right there to go to the uh, uh, fortress. But I am going to save state here. Bowser's back door. And see what this has to offer. If it is just a quick back door. It is. That is why I save stated. So we saw the back door. That is a super big shortcut. Bowser's Castle. We will do this. So get thrown in here. This falls. Huh. I was kind of expecting more blocks to fall and have like uh, extra doors you could go in. So. Uh, I'll probably... Actually, I will do the Bowser fight. Super easy, simple. I don't know what I was thinking there. I don't... I don't... I don't even... That really... I don't even know what I was thinking there. Maybe I'll end with 98 lives. Because I doubt I will get a life in here. Coins would probably be the only way I could see getting a life in this level. And again, I don't think I will get enough to do that. Yeah. It's like, that's what I was trying to do, but I went too far backwards and <laughs> just died. Actually, I may get enough coins. Let's gather all the coins I can find! No dragon coins, though, it seems. But I'm halfway there. Probably won't find 50 more coins. Just doesn't seem like something that would be in this level. Wish I had my cape still. Not hard, but I just kind of wish I had my cape. Okay. Yeah, so I'm going to end with uh, 98 lives. 
And to do Bowser now. Okay, come on. Bowser is so... Just an easy fight. So easy of a fight. It's just ridiculous how easy he is. For being like... Oh, that was dumb of me. For being the final boss and all. With how easy his fight is, you think it would be harder. You think there'd be more substance to it, but at the same time, all the uh, Koopalings only had three hits per. So, I mean, it kind of makes sense that uh, Bowser's not going to be that much of a problem. Bop. And throw the mushroom that I don't need. And hit him. And he'll throw the ball and then two Mecha Koopas. So even though I was uh, late on getting one because I accidentally, you know, killed one of the Mecha Koopas, I will be slightly ahead because I'll have an extra Mecha Koopa going into the third round. Or not. Or, or I will, because I am doing so poorly. Oh. I, well, he's going to throw one more out. So I can wait until he throws one more. Okay, come on. No! 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 What are you doing? This is the longest Bowser fight I've ever had, honestly. And the very few times I actually get hurt during one of them. By the thing. Oh man. There we go. That is what I wanted. Freaking A, that was that took a whole lot longer than it really should have. Um, I think that's gonna land on I was safe where I was. So one hit. He'll throw the Mecha Koopas. And I will get another hit on him. And there we go. Peach. Like right there. Right under me. Or right on top of me, rather. And there we go. Mario's adventure is over. Mario, the princess, Yoshi, and his friends are going to take a vacation. Fast forward time. Because... Yeah, those aren't changed at all. Nintendo's going to have a field day with this episode. I'm going to have to change probably all the colors of everything. But anyway, that has been another Mario World, and I will be back later with another adventure next time. See you guys then.